friends how are you guys today today i will show you a video about daemon tools light 10.9 version guys it's a uh, it's a new software it's called daemon tools light 10.9 version yeah it's a software about uh, <coughs> it basically it mounts the files it mounts the files of iso file type if you don't know what's a iso file type like uh, the windows files like if you're downloading any kind of windows windows 7 windows 8 or windows 10 from from internet basically if you're downloading they will be downloaded in iso file type like exe f many file types are exe and some f familiar file types so one is called iso file type so you can search it on google there are many kinds of softwares that can open the iso file but the best software for this is daemon tools lite 10.9 version so I'm today I'm going to show you and tell you some tips and tricks about this how to use daemon tools uh, so friends first of all you have to download this uh, software I have that uh, I will post a description link download download link in the description below download that uh, this software from the description link is a media file link guys I put in media file so download download here download it from that link you will get this version daemon tools right 10.9 there are many daemon tools uh, version like if you if you write daemon tools on google there will be like daemon tools original daemon tools light daemon tools some other stuff but if you download this software this one i only download this one daemon tools light don't do not download any other software and first of it will ask you for a license if you have a paid license or <coughs> a free license so i so as you can see here guys i have a free license it's a free license limited support means you can either buy it if you have the money you can buy it and buy the full pack it's written here full pack is forty dollars twenty nine point nine nine for the high half price you can activate it but you don't do not need to buy this because uh, you can open your ISO file with free license also limited supported you can open your uh, any file any type of file for, from this so first of all I will tell you this is the home this is images drives settings license image editor burn VSD USB so there are many options in this go to the settings and do not uh, mess with the settings guys the default settings are, this are the same so I didn't mess up the settings the these are the default settings you can change your language if you have any other language I have English language this is integration do not mess it up it can open these types of files if you have ISO file, MD, MDG, IMG, CHD, TC, CUE, all these type of files are supported in this software. These files, if you, if you can't open them, you can use daemon tools to open them. It will mount your file. It will basically mount your image file. ISO is, ISO is a type of image file. This software mounts an image file. So you can set the custom folders to any path in your Windows drive. This is the confirmation. Do not mess up the setting, guys its default settings do not mess it up so we will start with the basics the images this is the main thing the images if you click on images two types will come ISCSI you have to buy this one if you have if you have to use virtual hard disk and physical drives like remote images <coughs> you have to buy this one but if you have a regular image file like I've shown you in the settings the integration these all types of, of these files MDX, MD5 MDS, MDF, ISO, IMG, image. So go to images and click click on this plus add image. And if you have any kind of image, it will show like this. I have this harvest moon back to nature. It's kind of a game. It's a CUE file, but many of you can have ISO file. It's written over here. So just click on it. Click it on. It will show it up here. Let's like say PlayStation One. But it's a it's a game of a it's a PlayStation One game, guys. So I don't have any. Uh, really important file over here so which, can I'm, which I can mount so just click on it, it the image will show up there are many options will come will come you can convert it you can burn it you can edit it you can open the file location delete it you can mount advanced mount it but you have to mount it just click on mount the noise will come you see F drive is mounted now I will go to the F drive see this F drive it's it's mounted all the files have come in it will show you that it's a CD-ROM it will be app drive if you don't have a app drive you can have any other options I will show you not right now 
if you want to unmount it click on right click it and press unmount guys this is the F file you can exit over here but suppose you don't have any file you have you don't have any other F drive G drive any other file uh, you can quick mount it and do it like this it will again do this F file you can again eject it from here and you can delete it also it doesn't delete your image uh, all your game file will only delete your images like this image file do press this add image like all type of images file virtual hard disk true crypt images clone disk media description any kind of file if you want to open you can open through here Nero images just press on this one and it will just come you can also enter the advanced image mount this is for advanced option this is for this is for a this is a paid feature oh yeah it's a paid feature but you do not need this kind of features in this you don't you not do not need to buy buy this one you can do it you can do it without buying also guys you do not need to buy this one so here you go you can easily mount your image any type of you can mount many as images as you want two three files if you can it will open your file into a CD-ROM or DVD-ROM so that you can access those files you can download anything moving on to the next step is the drives if you want to like uh, just like add drive add adjust advanced settings for the new drive burn the disks it can burn an image you know how to burn an image guys copy a disk burn data disk erase a disk burn an audio disk these all features are al available for a price <coughs> these features are available for for a price guys you have to pay for them but if you want like <coughs> a free feature it's the main feature of this daemon tool is the image file guys it mount it mounts the image the iso files and mainly files are isos if you want to download any windows file any any kind of game file you can use this software it's easy enough to do it like if i click on add drive it will ask me DT SCSC where if you do if you don't want to add a drive like suppose you want G drive H drive M drive N drive you can go there and add a drive on it like if you want W drive or any kind of drive you want extra external drive it will make it it will make a virtual copy of your disk insert your dr disk inside and it will make a copy of it <coughs> like if you have ISO format MDX M MDS MDS format yeah if you want to create a bootable use USB if you want to up, uh, upload any kind of Windows 7 Windows 8 any kind of it you can do it all these softwares are there all these options are there in one software it's called daemon tools Lite. so I'm gonna unmount it right now and click on delete it will ask this for sure and you can just click on X and yes you can see the notification from here also you can go for help you can you can this just simply click on mount and your image file will come any type of image file and one more technique is that if if you do not want to open this software just go to your file it will automatically detect like this harvest moon back to nature this game automatically detects on it just click on it and there you go it's made it's done <coughs> so guys i hope you find my video interesting guys because many few people know how to use daemon tools light only download this version it's uh, mentioned in the description below guys i hope you like my video guys so this is a short video yes but hopefully i will be back with another video guys tomorrow so take care of yourself guys peace out goodbye